I prepared two sets of conceptual buildings for you to see. This is set one. We'll go to the aerial. This is camera's aerial camera, but it's at the same elevation all the way around. We can show the second floor call outs we can for the for each room. Just all proposed, all conceptual. It's basically a a building with a central corridor hall, if you will, and a central atrium with stairs at both ends. And administrations generally on the second floor. Let's go to the the walkthrough itself and go through the major single corridor and we can see the atrium area and how it how it looks the space the people in it I've got some orange arrows here on the floor to show you that this is the door I'd like for you to go into to see the the classroom this is a typical classroom it's with the desks yeah, the desks can change just to give you a gist of what a classroom will look like and get out of the classroom I think I'm going to go around these people here and you can have a I put in a decorative floor and sh are showing a decorative floor you see the second floor office administration the first floor is all going to be classrooms now we can put windows in the in the walls to see into the classrooms don't have to be enclosed like we've shown them this walkthrough is all enclosed an interior walkthrough if you will whereas this set two of the conceptual buildings will be an exterior walkthrough I can put them both together and have interior and exterior you can go in and out of the buildings if you want this is set up the same with the same principles as the first one I'm just calling out the third floor and showing an atrium with the administration on the third floor of this particular building but I'm also showing white buildings that are supposed to be existing buildings but I'm not sure exactly where the existing buildings are so I've just put those in as generic buildings you can also excuse me see the I call them the anchor buildings it gives you a sense of whether you want to go up high with those or go down low with those and we'll see here in a second I'll put it into the walkthrough and we'll just walk right through this I'm gonna put it in run speed run and walk but I just wanted to get to this point here and show you how the the space works and I'm going to go ahead and take the buildings up again now the blue is supposed to be for the hokey stone and of course it won't be hokey stone across the windows we'll work something else out but I just wanted to show you it also ref the blue is not straight around the building it reflects the the shape of them in the form of the mountains in the background which I don't show it's on site so if I knew exactly where this was on site I could be able to put those in I did some etching in the windows just to give it some flare what I'm going to do now is kind of play the hurry up game if you will I'm gonna go ahead and fly and I'll back out so you can see I go into fly mode and we can see if I had more buildings I knew where the site was I could add more to this It just all depends. We will we'll have to get together to program the buildings and your needs and spaces. And once you do that, the the shape and the form and the look will will come together. I'm just coming back down to land, if you will, on the ground. I just wanted to show you that this is a 3D model. Yes, a lot of people develop 3d models but I can send this to you in its own viewer and you can view it and you can present it also at your own 
own time and it's a pretty powerful tool. I just wanted to let you see it. Thank you.